Also new at 10, Greenville City officials listening to public opinion regarding Uptown's new parking plan during tonight's City Council meeting. Now, not in your sides, Caitlin Richards was at this meeting, and Caitlin, there could be some changes to this newly implemented plan. That's right, Courtney. The City Council voted on a motion to adapt the parking plan. Since the plan took effect on January 1st, residents and business owners have been weighing in on the changes. City Council Member William Bell brought the parking plan topic back up during Monday's City Council meeting, giving the public a chance to voice their opinions on the new plan after being in place for a week. Business owners raised their concerns, such as being dependent on an app to pay for parking and there not being enough free parking. After hearing the public's input, the parking plan was represented with added changes to meet some concerns. Some of the changes include adding kiosks to the Uptown District, which would take 30 to 60 days to install, allowing payment for parking without having having to use the mobile app. City Council members went back and forth on trying to decide what the best next step for the parking plan would be. Bell presented the motion to extend the education period of the plan from January to March with no citations so the public can have more time to adjust, as well as extend on-street parking from one hour free parking to two hours free parking. The motion passed in a five to one vote. I would hope that you know, people are going to get the message, people understand it, and over time they will. Um, all, all of these things can be corrected and fixed as long as we take the time to listen to our patrons and listen to the small businesses uptown. Right now, during this period, there will be no citations given in Uptown. WNCT will continue to follow this story and bring the latest information on air and online. In studio, Caitlin Richards, 9 on your side.